Michael, who brought you to the sound. You play as a musician. The cult love. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I, I was a fan of music from the very beginning. Um, you know, as a, as a young, as a young kid growing up. Um, <laughs> I used to, was forced to listen to what my brother listened to, and I was forced to listen to what my sister listened to. And they were listening to, my brother was listening to Earth, Wind & Fire, and the Ohio Players, and Johnny Taylor, and a lot of R&B stuff. And my sister was listening to Tom Petty, The Smiths, um, Kiss. Um, and I later on got into punk, you know. Uh, suicidal and bad brains and the descendants and, and the misfits um, but I still was searching for stuff on my own and, and the record that spoke to me the most was The Cult Love The Cult Love <laughs> No, I still listen to that, seriously, I, I, I do um, uh, <clears throat> So uh, you know, I, I listen to. This might sound weird, but I, I I listen to you know Rihanna. I listen to Rufus Wainwright. I listen to Elton John. I listen to The Doors. Um, I listen to this band called Black Mastiff. I've been playing them a lot. Um, so I, I, you know, I'm a, I'm a fan of of all kinds of music. Thank you, Charles. Uh, a music style that I don't like. Uh, you know, I. There is stuff that I don't like. I, I'm trying to think. <laughs> um, you know, I. I can't think of anything right off, right off the... I love reggae. I love reggae. R&B? Um, you know, rhythm and blues, there's nothing wrong with rhythm and blues, man. You know, I mean, you know, when some people say R&B, you, you immediately think something like R. Kelly. Now, okay, okay, now, I, I don't like R. Kelly, okay? I'm not a big fan, so... Um, but you know, rhythm and blues. You know, ry rhythm and blues. Rhythm and blues. Yeah. You know, it. You know, I'm a. You know, I, I grew up on 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 again on what my older brother was listening to. I mean, that was a lot of soulful R&B stuff too. I mean, that was Earth, Wind, and Fire, Johnny Taylor, Ohio Players. Um, I mean, that stuff is 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 engraved. You know, so. I, you know, I'm a fan of music. I, you know, I don't, I don't want to. I don't have any guilty pleasures. If I say that I listen to Rihanna, who gives a fat rat's ass? Who cares? I, I, why, why should I? Why should I have a, a guilty pleasure? I don't want to be cool. I don't need. To, I don't need to be cool. The only people I need to be cool to is well, not really cool. Is that that I that I that I you know that I really care about what they think about me or my kids and my wife. And everything else is, you know, it is what it is. You know, there's can, there's always haters, there's always shit talkers, there always will be. People so bored with their own lives, they need a little bit of drama from somebody else's life to make theirs more complete. And they can go eat a dick as far as I'm concerned. moment, it happens to you on stage. Uh, I don't want to talk about it. It's too embarrassing. <laughs> no, come on, now I want to know it. <laughs> uh, you know, there's, you know, anytime you walk up on, you, know, you walk up on stage, you know, you get a little embarrassed. I, I still do. I get nervous, and you know, you're up there exposing yourself. You know, you're up there putting your, putting your heart and soul, singing, singing your ass off. So. Uh, it's, you know, it's 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 always a little embarrassing getting up there and, and doing that. You remember the wildest stage will be. 
uh, you know. You know, I, 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 I well, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not a rock star, so you know, we can, we can fucking throw that out the window. I'm, I'm a, I'm a dad and a husband, and 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 like I said before, I don't want to be cool. I don't want to be a cool rock star. I just want to be me, and and I'm, I'm not some wannabe rock star thinking that I am backstage. I don't have a I don't have a cool hat, you know what I mean? I, I don't, and and I don't want to have a, have a cool hat. Um, but some of the craziest stuff that I've have seen backstage, you know, has been with the Dwarves or and or with Danzig, and uh, you know, there's you always hear about those things where you hear about you know there's sex, drugs, and fucking rock and roll, and that's what you get, you know. And I you know I I so. No, it's, it's, no. I, can't, I don't want to say anything too incriminating. you guys, I you got a different feeling with the music, like the kids right now. So, how do you, how do you, how do you think it's gonna be the link between internet and the music? Well, it's it's already pretty heavy. I mean, try to imagine your life without without email. It's, you know, I I'm half tempted to get rid of my email, but I'm already attached. You remember? You're old enough to remember without what it was to be without email, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. I'm 33. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. So you're 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 old enough. Um, me. Yeah, well, I remember. You know, when I was in high school. We set up the recording cassette with dates. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. It was in your in your life, in your life. Yeah. When you uh, when you listen to the music, you want to share the music with the other friends. You want to try you for the music taste, right? That's exactly right. And now. You just just a click of a button, and you can send it to your friend, and you know, I I, I think it's great. You know, I th that's that's you know, sharing music is it's always great. I'm old enough for you know, I, I was I used to go to the store and buy eight tracks. That's how old I am. You know, uh, but 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 you know, and and that's great, and we've you know we've come a long way, and. And, uh, you know, technology is, it is what it is. I, you know, I, I, I don't, I don't spend a lot of time thinking about that. I don't, I, you know, I haven't really thought about it too hard, man. I mean, I, I again, I'm, I'm more concerned with, with, uh, you know, what type of fishing bait I'm going to use when I take my kids fishing when I get home. That's what I think about. You know, and I, I try to keep my eye on the ball a little bit. And I'm, I, you know, I'm a simpleton, and I don't. And it, it, it is what it is, you know. So it's. Yeah. Well, again, I'm, I'm not a rock star, and I'm not a celebrity. <laughs> you keep on saying that, but I, I'm not. But there's, there's no, you know, the, you know I, I appreciate people that that are into the music and and that follow my career. I'm I'm, I'm appreciative to that fact, and and, and uh, you know, I, I it's 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 an honor to be able to to get up on stage and, and to share those feelings and emotions with some of these people that have felt what I felt when I when I you know sing and play some of that stuff so I appreciate it it's it's a it's it does not go unappreciated at all and I'm I'm lucky to be even here talking to a complete and total stranger about something that I created and that blows my mind so all good things. Can you say hello to Black Zine Italy? Who? Black Zine Italy. Black Zine Italy? Hello, Black Zine Italy.